be a building right there with a little car dealership with that big old flag. It's all gone. Gone with the wind. <laughs> That is so awesome. Old school BMX. Oh yeah. Loud mouth. So good day, greetings, and welcome to Monday, October the 23rd, 2023. Currently here in Plattsburgh, New York. This is the uh, second stop out of two for the day. My first stop was in Messina, New York. Had a 6 a.m. appointment. Showed up there at 5.30. They came out at 5 or 6. I backed in, and at 5 after 6, they were bringing my paperwork out to me because I was done. They had eight pieces. That's it. And uh, right now it's 20 after 8. I have a uh, 9.30 appointment here in Plattsburgh. Just took a quick walk around the uh, property here. Just waiting for them to come in so we can uh, pop the seal, open the doors, back her in, and get her unloaded. Well, it's 9.30 a.m. and I am back in and getting unloaded. Happy Monday. All right. So it is high noon, 12 o'clock. Arrived here at 8 a.m., 9.30 appointment. Finally got back in at 9.30. They finished up about 10 minutes ago. Got my paperwork, computer work done. I gotta watch this wall over here and the corner over there, make sure I don't get any walls or yellow posts. And then I'll roll down this alleyway like I always do which kind of goes kind of slow because it's nice and smooth and yada 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 all right look, looks good to go over there going to uh <laughs> I uh, have a guitar with me and I have it up on the little shelf in there and uh, that little bump back there just knocked it off onto the uh the bed back there. That's okay. It's got a, a good padded gig bag. Anyway, rolling across town. Going to pick up a load. Not sure if it's going to uh, Canandaigua or uh, the other place. It was Kearney, New Jersey, I think it is. We put Kearney's Point, New Jersey. It could be either or. It could be either one of them. I haven't looked at the uh, message yet. But uh, as of right now, I have Wow, everything's falling out today. It's pretty bumpy in here today. But uh, as of right now, I got three hours and 58 minutes. So uh, unless I can get the load picked up in time to where I can get a 16 hour extension deal, I will be getting stuck out today, which is not a big deal. These things happen. 
dropping and hooking, hooking and dropping, dropping and hooking trailers. That is dropping and hooking, hooking and dropping, dropping, hooking, dropping, hooking, dropping, hooking trailers. Plattsburgh, New York. Just dropped the empty trailer. Oh, I see why. Aha. Uh -huh. Just hooked up to the loaded trailer. Now we're locked. Okay. Well, I'll show you this real quick. The handle. When you pull it out, it got this little metal notch on there. Pulls the handle out so that the uh, pins will release. And when I put it in, it caught on there. So the pins are locking, but not all the way. But now it's all the way over there. The pins are locked. It's pretty rusty under here. It's good to go. That all makes sense that I talk too fast. Just checking to make sure the pins are uh, good. I already know that the lights and the tires are good because I already checked the tires and kicked the lights a couple of times. Good to go, ready to roll. I just gotta find out if I can get the uh, extension or if I'm staying out tonight. About to find out. Well, uh, so far, everything looks pretty good. It's an older trailer, it's all old and rusty. But hey, you do the best you can with what you got. And uh, someday I'll learn how to talk. Okay, just got word from the powers that be. I can use a two hour extension to make it back to Syracuse gonna make this happen. Tape rolling and three, two, one, action. Whew, okay. So today I got, well I used the uh, two hour extension to get home, or back to Syracuse that is, 15 hours and 40 minutes for the day. Got back to the yard, dropped the loaded trailer, topped off my fuel tanks, took care of my paperwork, hooked up to an empty trailer for the morning. Gonna go pick up a load to take down to HQ. And then we'll see what happens after that. But, uh, right now I'm gonna go home and uh, get a bite to eat and take a nap. Come back tomorrow and do it all over again. Well, good day and greetings and welcome to Tuesday, October the 24th, 2023. Uh, that's not cool. That is not cool at all. That there, my friends, is a coolant leak. Nice. Just went and grabbed some coolant. Down for local pilot. I'm gonna top this off and uh, I'm heading down to HQ today anyway. I'll have them check it out when I get down there. Oh, what a great way to start the day. Out here in Camillus, New York, taking care of the old drop and hook blues. Picked up a load that's going to Lewistown, Pennsylvania, which I am taking down to HQ. Talked to the mechanic in the shop. There's a good chance I'm going to probably be uh, switching trucks today, which is just awesome. Pure awesomeness. Something I enjoy doing so much as of late. And, uh, well, this is a quick fix, but. Anyway, so getting ready to roll down to uh, HQ. Didn't really get off to a good start today. Really not too impressed. These things happen. It's nothing worth getting upset over. It's just, uh, <laughs> you know, it's just, you like to have a good day every day, you know? And uh, hopefully today gets better. I got to roll. Okay, so here's the situation. I need to learn how to shift today. <laughs> okay, there we go. Now we're rolling. Down here in beautiful Tobihana, Pennsylvania. Just took care of the old drop and hook blues. 
But before this, picked up a load up there in Camillus, New York, took it down to HQ, dropped it, had the uh, shop look at the uh, coolant leak. Uh, they believe it was just a clamp that goes to a coolant line that goes to the turbo, which there was turbo work done to this truck recently in Binghamton, New York, and it's already gone back there once for uh, stuff that didn't get tightened properly. So the mechanic tightened the, uh, the clamp down. I was told to uh, keep an eye on it. And then they gave me a, a gallon of coolant to keep just in case. Very nice of them. They hooked up to an empty trailer which uh, had to have a marker light replaced. It had a small hole in the nose which they put some silicone on. And then they had to uh, change the tire. Change the tire, marker light, little pinhole. So that's all squared away. I just dropped that trailer down here in Tobihana. Picked up a loaded trailer. I'm gonna head back to the yard in Syracuse and uh, take my break. It's a beautiful day up here in the northeast. It's 62 degrees Fahrenheit, which is awesome, pure awesomeness. It's supposed to be possibly in the 70s for a couple days, which is pretty sweet. And uh, even though this morning started out a little frustrating, it's been a halfway decent day, so you can't really complain about that. But on my way back to Syracuse, I think I covered everything. Uno, dos, you know what to do, right? Okay, back in the yard here in Syracuse. Topped off my fuel tanks. I've got my load for tomorrow. My uh, routine run up to Plattsburgh. It's a beautiful afternoon. It's 69 degrees Fahrenheit. I think I'm going to go home and take a quick walk and then uh, get something to eat, take a nap. That's the plan, man. That's the plan. Good day and greetings and welcome to Wednesday. It's hump day. October the 25th, 2023. Out here in the yard in Syracuse. Just checked the tires, kicked the lights. Made sure the fifth wheel was secure and tight. It appears that the Arizona Diamondbacks and the Texas Rangers have both made the World Series. That's great. Let's go Expos. And uh, I'm rolling north today. It's a uh, routine type of day. You know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? stay there. Up here in Plattsburgh, New York. Got up here around 7.30, back in about quarter of. It's now 8.30. And uh, the trailer is empty. I'm going to go sweep it out, find out where I'm off to, which I'm pretty sure I'm going across town. The guy hit here. The, the guy here. <laughs> anyway, the guy here said, we'll see you tomorrow. So I don't know if I'm coming back tomorrow or what's going on. 
and I told him I tell everybody else. I don't know what I'm doing until uh, they let me know because I work on a need to know basis. If I need to know what it is I'm doing, dispatch lets me know. Not too bad today. Not too bad at all. Just stepped on the handle again. Oh, it's raining, it's pouring. The old man is snoring. Bumped his head, went back to bed, and didn't wake up till morning. Oh, that sounds awesome, doesn't it? It just occurred to me that I think I left the window open on the truck. I might have a wet seat. Well, that's awesome. I rolled the window up after all. So, uh, no wet ass at this moment. <laughs> oh, what a day. What a week. What a week it's been so far. So good day and greetings from the uh, Plattsburgh Truck Wash where the truck wash is always free. You just bring your own soap and as always, I forgot the soap. Oh, that is the best sound of the day right there. Unfortunately, it's not time for that. All right, let's see here. Arrived at Shipper. Send. That way they know that I am here. Okay, I gotta go in and uh, check in and uh, find out what's going on here. And uh, I'm gonna dance in the raindrops and try to stay dry. Good times. Ooh, shut that racket right off. Okay. Love that sound. Here's the situation. I say that way too much. Anyway. <laughs> Just took care of the old drop and hook blues up here in Plattsburgh. I came in to pick up a load for Carney's Point, New Jersey, which is not done yet. The product hasn't even been made yet. Should be done sometime tomorrow. So I'm picking up a load that's going to Canandaigua, which another driver was supposed to pick up, but he's not gonna be here until, I don't know, around noon, shortly after. Right now it's going on 10 o'clock. So I'm picking up the load that that driver was supposed to pick up and he's picking up a load that they are loading currently so everybody gets a load and we're all happy yay round of applause but just gotta take care of the old paperwork computer work and then uh make like a sheep herd and get the flock out of here and roll back to Syracuse. <laughs>
I think that uh, I think that it's time to mow my face. It's starting to bug me a little bit. do a little uh, e-log crawl here. That there is second gear. This ain't one of those D is for drive trucks. This is one of those uh, trucks with an Eaton full or 10 speed for our transmission. Up here in Plattsburgh, New York, typical routine uh, run here. It's Thursday, October the 26th, 2023. Arrived here at 7.15, backed in at 7.35, and right now it is uh, quarter after nine in the morning. Gonna check the trailer, call dispatch, find out where I'm off to next, probably across town, because I know that there's a load over there that was getting loaded yesterday that uh, might be ready by now. You never know. Never know what's going on. Never know what you're doing. That's what happens when you work on a need to know basis. Living in the moment. Living the now. Make it happen. It's the little things like that noise right there that make life good. Even though it's not time for that yet. Oh, where are they? Oh, there they are. All right, just checking. I can only see the corner of the screen here using the visor cam. Okay, I got my glasses on, got the seatbelt on. Oh, boy. Okay, up here in Plattsburgh, still. Across town from where I was previously. Just took care of the old drop and hook blues. Just picked up a load that is going out to Carney's Point, New Jersey. Which I am taking back to the yard in Syracuse. Making it happen on this routine run Thursday. Ooh, excuse me. All in all, it's been a uh, pretty decent day. Of course, most uh, days that are just routine are pretty decent, which is a good thing. Not a lot going on today. Just the usual uh, making it happen like I always do and repeating things I said the first time because sometimes I repeat myself in case you didn't hear me the first time. Sometimes I repeat myself in case you didn't hear me the first time. But now that I'm thinking about it, I don't know if I repeated myself or not. <laughs> Welcome to my world. <laughs> oh boy. Alright, I'm rolling out. Excuse me. Back here in the yard in Syracuse, dropped the trailer, topped off the fuel tanks, got my assignment for tomorrow, which is basically the same thing that I did today and yesterday. Same stuff, different day, but tomorrow is Friday. And uh, there's no such thing as a bad Friday.
That might be a little crooked. That's okay. Nothing wrong with being a little crooked, right? Ask politicians, they'll tell you. <laughs> oh boy, okay. Good day and greetings. Welcome to Friday, October the 27th, 2023. It's the uh, typical, usual, routine run up here in Plattsburgh, New York. Made my delivery, then uh, came across town over here just to carry the old drop and hook blues. Picked up a load that's going back to Canandaigua, New York, which I will drop in the yard. Same old, same old. It's been raining on and off today. Temperature right now, according to the Bulldogs, 64 degrees Fahrenheit. Supposed to be uh, in the lower 70s tomorrow, but rainy. And uh, I'm getting my truck inspected tomorrow and getting some new tires mounted tomorrow. So that'll be a good time. And uh, right now, heading back to the yard in Syracuse. Looking forward to the weekend like I always do. And uh, I can't believe October, I mean, Rocktober is almost done and over with. It's November's almost here. Great. Is this spring yet? <laughs> Not looking forward to winter. Well, who wins? Unless you have a snowmobile, then of course you're looking forward to winter, but not I. Oh man, it's a beautiful day outside. It's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. Back here in the yard in Syracuse, just dropped the loaded trailer, topped off the fuel tanks, took care of the paperwork, computer work everything that needs to be taken care of. My work week is done. Let's see, what do we got this week? 65 hours and five minutes this week. That's a, gonna be a pretty good check next week. Whew. No major plans for the weekend as of yet, but uh, it's supposed to be nice, even though tomorrow it's supposed to rain and I've gotta get some tires mounted and the inspection done on my pick em up truck, but these things happen. At least it's not snow just yet. Not ready for that. So uh, till next time, I'll catch y'all later. Y'all have a good one, eh? I am out of here. Oh, yes, I am. Hasta la pasta. Adios. Happy trails, everybody. Happy trails.